Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. Today I'm going to show you something really quick. I'm going to show you how to log into your WordPress account if you've forgotten your password. Now this happens to the best of us, so please don't worry. First things first, you probably know this, but you can access the login screen for your WordPress site by typing in your domain name and then either forward slash wp-admin, or you can also just type in forward slash admin after your website URL. Once you're on the login page, click on the lost your password link. This will take you to a page where you can enter your username or the email address associated with your account. WordPress will then send you an email with a link to reset your password. But what if you don't receive the email? Well, don't panic. There are a few things you can do. First off, check your spam folder. Sometimes these emails can get caught up in there. If it's not there, try adding wordpress.org to your email whitelist and request another password reset email. If that still doesn't work, you can try resetting your password manually through the database. Now, this may sound scary, but it's actually pretty simple. And truth be told, you can usually just contact your host and they'll take care of this for you. If you feel like doing this yourself, you can go into your WordPress website hosting account and access PHP My Admin. Find the database associated with your WordPress installation and locate the WP underscore users table. Click on edit next to your username and enter a new password in the user underscore pass field. Also make sure to select MD5 from the drop down menu next to it. It's just a thing you need to do. Now, once you've done that, save your changes and try logging in again with your new password. And that's it. You're usually back in business. Now, another thing I will say, if you find that your WordPress website isn't sending any emails at all, there are some steps you can take with email logs and SMTP plugins to make sure that that connection is happening properly. I hope that this short video was helpful for those of you who are experiencing login issues with WordPress. As always, keep track of your passwords, change them regularly. It's just really good practice for security. Thanks for watching and please tune in again for more super fast WordPress tips. Thanks.